What was dismissed as science fiction not long ago now finds its way into our lives. Service robots will take the pressure off and support people with everyday things. For example, by taking over logistical tasks, provide all-round support with care, and enable handicapped people to regain mobility. At Automatica 2014 in Munich, professional service robotics is a new exhibition highlight. The platform for automated production processes is exhibiting not only innovations in robotics, assembly and handling engineering and industrial image processing, but also the latest assistance systems that in the future will lend people a hand in industrial processes as well as in daily use. The Technical University of Munich showcases its humanoid robot, Roboy. I can be happy. I can be mad. I can be surprised. The humanoid has 48 engines. The movements are controlled by wires. The skeleton was created entirely in a 3D printer. Of course, Roboy can also interact with his counterpart. I'm so shy. I always say Roboy's development is finished when I can put it in a kindergarten for a week and get him back in one piece. This is certainly a next step as an application. We think Roboy is a very advanced toy for children and can be used as a learning tool. At the Chair of Applied Mechanics at the TU in Munich, a manipulator for use in agriculture is being developed. The goal of this development, funded with research funds from the EU, is the targeted harvesting of fruits. Mounted on a mobile platform, this robot will take over tasks in the fields, which can't be carried out efficiently enough by people. But the robot will not replace people. Of course, one always bears in mind, in the background, it is a technical system that also has certain assurances to offer here. And I think that it will definitely happen, but it will take another 20 years. However, the rewalk is already reality. André from Berlin has been a paraplegic for 10 years. The portable motorized exoskelet from Argo Medical gives paraplegic people like him their upright mobility back. When I get into the rewalk from my wheelchair and strap myself in, then I just feel I want to run, run and just run. A forward tilt of the upper body triggers the first step. Crutches are used for stabilization during the movement. Even climbing the stairs is possible. The rewalk personnel will cost around 63,000 euros. The system will be introduced to the general public at the next Automatica in Munich. <laughs>